start with uh, uh, the Caspian Sea Monster, which I okay. love that name. Okay. And although it has two names, really, the mm -hmm. Caspian Sea Monster and it's the um, Agronoplan? Agronoplan. Hey, that was, that was pretty close. <laughs> <laughs> right, Russian pronunciation. Agronoplan, which is a, well, why don't you, while you're pulling those over, why don't you explain what the, what the plane is that this is named after? It's a special uh, plane which uh, designed for flights above uh, surface of sea, mm -hmm. three four meters above water, and this special and this plane used spe used special ground effect and um, how to say air pillow between uh, wings and the water, kind of like a hovercraft. Mm -hmm. Okay. And um, this effect uh, allow, um, uh, allows to to uh, to carry super uh, heavy um, loads. Heavy loads. Right. And uh, for example, up to one thousand tons. This uh, Ekrano Plan KM, mm -hmm. uh, which was built uh, in sixties, was able to carry up to one thousand tons. Or I would assume that's that's Oh, right. sorry, 500 tons or up to 1,000 passengers. Wow. Okay. So mm -hmm. this is was, was was quite a quite an airplane. It was even even more powerful in this uh, in this uh, how to say more, more powerful than Maria plane. Hmm. But so it's kind of not it's not really. It's not really an airplane, it's kind of something as a hybrid. He could be as airplane too. He oh, could okay. fly uh, up to 3,000 meters too. Oh, okay. All right. But the best effect was above water. He could be as normal plane as uh, uh, a ground plane. plane. The power that it, it had yes. was from when it was creating yes. that cushion yes. with the water. Mm -hmm. So that was the inspiration of this watch. This is the first.